Missouri need to do more when it comes to protecting child victims of sexual exploitation and human trafficking. That's according to a new report. The now Tara Hall is here to break down what this all means. Yeah, it's all from Shared Hope International. It's a nonprofit organization that grades all 50 states every year on how to prevent uh, sex trafficking, protect the child victims, and prosecute perpetrators. Now, it gave Kansas and Missouri a C and a B, respectively. Child sex exploitation and trafficking. It's a global problem that's happening right here in the metro. Lots of times the exploitation begins by them having to trade a sexual favor for a ride, for a hamburger at McDonald's, for a couch to sleep on. Um, you know, all of those things come into play when kids are out there on the streets. Chris Wade with the Justice Project says the Shared Hope International's report shines a spotlight on Kansas's and Missouri's need to improve state and local resources to prevent child sex exploitation. The states received grades of a C and a B, respectively. This is generally the result of a decision that they've made as a result of a lack of choices because when you say, oh, they made the choice to do this, uh, that implies that they have options, that they have other choices to choose from. And maybe at that point in time, they really felt like they had no other option. Shared Hope advises that both states increase penalties of offenders trafficking children, engaging in sex acts with children, and possessing child pornography to felonies with long prison sentences and high fines. These folks are somebody's mom, sister, daughter, brother, son. They've been through some pretty terrible things. Now, while there is more that Kansas and Missouri can do when it comes to protecting children, the state's reports are improving. So, for example, last year, Kansas received a 73.5, which is a grade of a C, but this year they received a 78, which is just shy of a B. And as far as Missouri is concerned, it received a, it received a B both last year and this year with a score of 85.5. Justin. All right. Thank you, Tara. Now to what's happening.